I think this is him calling. Hello? Yes, this is Detective Strauss, Phoenix Police Department. May I speak to Mr. Jeffrey White, please? Oh, uh, this is this is he. How you doing? I'm good, sir. How can I help you, sir? I'm actually calling because um I got uh wrapped up I don't even know, man. I was basically uh filming some stuff. Uh, there was supposed to be a fight that was going on, and I was recording it. And um, whatever the situation what was going on, I was not involved in it. I was just a bystander recording the incident, and which is my freedom of press. And I got swooped up with uh, the people that was involved in the situation that was going on, which I don't know. And as if I was involved in it, and I got my camera took. Um, the, the sergeant on the uh, at the time said it got took him for evidence but I was like you could have just took the SD card if you needed that and I also told him that uh, he needed a warrant to be able to go through my camera like that um, but of course they still went through it and you know I got released because I had nothing to do with it but it was just the point that I have freedom of press and I got my stuff taken and I feel like my rights are being violated right now with my camera being taken Considering that I had nothing to do with the situation, just an innocent bystander recording it. Okay. What, uh, what can I do for you? I'm trying to figure out how can I get my camera back. Well, your camera is a piece of evidence right now because it's got the uh, the fight on it. Okay. So, but you just need the memory, they don't the you? Where they took the camera, they, or they impounded it as a piece of evidence. It's got to stay impounded until the trial until this court case is finished. Once it's finished, then it'll be released back to you. So, I mean, if, I mean, you don't need the camera, you need the S, the memory, right? You need the SD card, the actual footage, correct? Well, uh, I don't know why they did, took what they did. They had a reason for it. They took the and camera. They impounded the whole camera. Um, they just don't take the cards out of the camera anymore. They take the whole thing. And this way it shows what camera it was from that it's your camera, that the card hasn't been tampered with or anything else like that, that it's still in the same condition as it was when you were recording it. So that's pretty much the reason why they took the whole camera. Okay, but it's what... It's now a piece of evidence, and it stays as evidence until the case is done. Okay, but what about my right to freedom of press? Well, you can record all you want, but there's a crime on it. So now it becomes evidence to the crime. So that pretty much ends that. You can record all you want. Once you record a crime, though, that's part of evidence for the court case. Okay, but I don't, I don't, okay, but what I'm not understanding is why was I, you know, uh, I got set down on the curve and put in handcuffs for an hour and 45 minutes behind this. Okay. All because I was... I wasn't out there, so I have no idea. If, yeah, you, I, you, if a sergeant was out there, you can contact him. And he'll be able to tell you everything because he was out there and I wasn't. So I have no idea about what occurred or anything else out there. I mean, you don't have a report? Yeah, but it doesn't say, I mean, you you want to know why you were put in handcuffs and sat down for an hour. I don't know. <sighs> wow. So how would I know, like, so pretty much I can just charge my camera to the game then, right? That my camera's lost? No, your camera's not lost. We have it. So how would I know about this court case, like? You'll be notified by mail when the camera is available for release. We'll send you a request. You'll come down to the property room and pick up the camera when it's time to release. And that's that address that the dude gave me on a piece of paper. The property management I, bureau. I don't know. What address did he give you? Uh, 100 East Elwood Street. Right. And you can only go down there when you've been notified that it's uh, ready to be released. Because you go down there now, it's a waste of trip because they can't release it to you. I guess. All right. All right. Okay, I'm sorry I can't do much more for you. Um, you 
you know, all of them. No, I just feel like it's, 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 I, I just. Your camera was taken. Yeah. You said the sergeant was out there. You could have asked him all those questions. He would have had a lot better. Well, I did ask some no, questions. I did. I did ask some questions, but they was being assholes on some real shit. You know what I'm saying? And I didn't want to keep talking to them, keep asking them questions and questions and questions. You know what I'm saying? All I was trying to do is find out why my camera was being taken and why I was put under arrest and sat on the curb for an hour and 45 minutes and I had nothing to do with the situation when I was just sitting there recording. Okay. Well, I can tell you why your camera was taken. For the rest of it, you have to talk to the officers that were out there. All right, cool. All right. Alright, man, y'all heard it yourselves, man. Ain't this about a bitch. So basically, you know what? It's a wrap. I'm charging my camera to the game. I got a new one anyways. You feel me? Like, it's bullshit. I had to sit on the curb for an hour and 45 fucking minutes because of some other motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn, straight up. So my shit got taken because I was recording a, cr a crime. A crime. Alright, well, it is what it is, man. Y'all know what it is, man. Fuck that motherfucking camera and fuck the motherfucking police officers that took my motherfucking shit, man. I'm still finna get it in. I'm still finna do what it do, man. And still hold it down for the town, man. You know what it is.